Hello Natalia, how are you doing today? Oh, not too bad, thank you. Good, good. Can you just remind me what we did in our last session? Oh, we did some traffic lights. Okay. Yeah. Can you tell me a little bit more about what we did and how we did it? Oh, just uh, you explain everything about traffic lights and uh, you told me through we was practicing a bit and it seems to be over good. Okay, yeah, yeah, good. So if there's any traffic lights we come across today, are you okay to deal with that? Yes, yes. That's really, really good. So what did we want to achieve today? Well, you said last time we're gonna practice in zebra crossing today. Okay, um, so pedestrian crossings, pedestrian, yeah? yeah? Okay, so if you scale for me, pedestrian crossings, where you feel you are now, so between naught to 10, Mm -hmm. Nought being it's totally horrendous, I know nothing, mm -hmm. and ten being I can deal with the traf uh, the crossings really good. Where would you put yourself? I would think two. Two, okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so where would you want that to be by the time we've finished? I don't know, five, six. Five, six, okay. And what would five and six feel like? Uh, well, it's would feel that I would have no, a bit more knowledge than I have at the moment. Okay, that, so that's... But I need uh, some support from you. Okay, so that, that sounds really good, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, what knowledge have you got at the moment about crossing? Oh, not much. Not much, much okay. Not much. Do you know how many different types there is? Uh, two or three, I'm sure. Two, two or three, can you name them two or three? Well, there's a uh, zebra crossing, definitely, and the ones which is controlled by the lights. Okay. I know they're different by the uh, control by lights, but yeah. I don't remember the names. Okay, so we've got five different types. Oh, yeah, right, okay. we've got Pegasus, which is awesome rider. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we probably won't see them, so we won't really worry about them. Uh, we've got Pelican. All right. We've got Toucan. Mm -hmm. We've got Puffin. Right. And we've got Zebra. Right. So Zebra is the black and white stripes across the road. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Pedestrians have the priority. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the, the Toucan is two can cross so cyclists and pedestrians mm -hmm. can cross together mm -hmm. yeah the puffing one is the intelligent crossing so when somebody presses the button the sensors on the top detect if there's anybody waiting and if there's not it doesn't stop the traffic yeah right. okay and then pelican yeah yeah so pelican you press the button it illuminates with weight on the box yeah and then it'll go through its cycle and it'll stop the traffic right and then go back to Mm -hmm. to normal but it has a flashing amber light do you know what the flashing amber light stands for it just uh, make sure is it clear before you proceed uh, that's it, yeah, uh, so you're sort of getting ready to go but if it's still uh, pedestrians on the crossing you can go that's it so if it's if it's safe on the crossing and there's nobody on it we can then proceed through mm -hmm. yeah okay. what is the one with a uh, uh, bulb yellow light that's like around school yeah school. just a zebra crossing that just is. a zebra yeah, crossing yeah. okay 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 so what do you need to do then to develop your pedestrian crossings well, i need help from you okay uh, you just maybe talk me through a couple of times okay yeah okay so talk you through is is that talking you through the routine or, and yeah, everything so around the crossing yeah practice and okay. okay and how many times do you say we need to do that Oh, I don't know, maybe two, three times. Two, three times, okay. Shall we go with two then and see how we get on? Yeah, okay. yeah sounds good. Okay, good, super. And how are we going to measure your success then, once we've done it two times? Uh, well, well, we will see what we achieved. <laughs> what? Okay, yeah, that sounds really good, yeah. So we'll see what we achieve. So after two times, we'll pull up and we'll park mm -hmm. and uh, we'll discuss it then, yeah. yeah okay so just before we move off then yeah yeah what we're going to do is we're just going to share responsibility mm -hmm. yeah so what i want you to do is drive the car nice and safely keep in line with the law of the road yeah mm -hmm. treat other road users with respect and obviously if it's there's a safety critical emergency i can deal with it because i can stop the car with a dual control mm -hmm. or can push the wheel away or pull it towards me mm -hmm. and if i have to do that we'll pull up and park on the left and we'll discuss it, yeah? Okay. Can you just repeat that back to me? Yeah, so I'm gonna drive nice, safely and following the law on the road and uh, 
respect other road users and if it's any dangerous situation you can you have a control so you can make some actions on it and you can touch the wheel pull it towards or out of okay yeah really good yeah really good so just before we move off then yeah are you okay to deal with everything apart from the pedestrian crossings yes yeah, yeah. okay that sounds really good so when you're ready then we'll move away mm -hmm. yeah okay so move off when you're ready Very nicely dealt with, well done. pedestrian crossing look mm -hmm. can you see the crossing yeah okay so check your mirrors that's it yeah. ease off your gas let's see the lady standing by it yeah. and she's just crossing yeah. yeah look at the box has it been pressed is it illuminated no okay yeah, so we can right. keep going through it's not going to change uh -huh. so it's nice okay. and slow like that yeah okay. does that make sense yep traffic lights we're going to turn left yeah remember everything that we did last week yep Well done. Well done. That seems really easy now. We've done that last week, yeah? Yeah. Good. It was really nice. So if you notice, look, mm -hmm. on, the cro on the traffic lights, there's a crossing, yeah? Right. But there's an island in the centre where the lights are in mm -hmm. the middle, look. So that's, that's what we call two crossings because they're both at different angles to each other. Right. Yeah, so it's only two crossings not one uh, so they're independent yeah so if you I'm press the button you. on the right you mm. could walk to the center but you couldn't walk mm. straight across again right. because okay. you've got to wait for the light okay. does that make sense yep. and if we look at the bus you see how he's just pressed the button like over there on the right yeah see how it's got illuminated yep. weight in the yep. box that's how we know it's been pressed mm -hmm. so if he'd have pressed it and walked away we still know it's illuminated and we have to be aware that it's going to change. This is the one smart one you said which is sort of no uh, No anybody... that's just a pelican because ah, it's got just... weight written on it mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. stay in the left hand lane for me on the roundabout okay. you okay to deal with the roundabout yes okay lovely. what if people say no then talk them through it okay so we've got crossing let's just ease yep. off check your mirrors yep. scan the area is there anybody there no nope. anybody press the button no. so we can keep moving through yeah I'm going to turn left at the traffic lights, so, yeah? Yeah.
so do you notice the sign look, on the left hand side yeah, but, uh, no, crossing uh, look yeah. yeah okay so we know there's a crossing coming up so we're going to check our mirrors yeah we're going to scan the area around the crossing yeah look Nobody at the box on the right hand side nobody's pressed it look yeah being aware of what's coming out there from the shots because people could run across to the crossing couldn't mm -hmm. they so we need to be aware of what's around us yeah does that mm -hmm. make sense yep so when you're walking how do you use a crossing uh, i never assume the car is going to stop for me uh, i still be careful if it's uh, with the lights i press the button and wait until and make sure even if it's showing green i still make sure the cars are stopped okay yeah that that so sounds that sounds really good yeah so tell me what you feel the difference is being the driver of the car then approaching the crossing well, it's from different side is it so i must make sure it's instead of cars approaching <laughs> i need to look out for the pedestrian approaching the crossing okay that's really good so there's no real difference is there you're yeah, just anticipating you, you, in yeah, a different way aren't you you, really? had to, you still had to be very careful around it that's it superb so you might be looking for people approaching using body language yes. so they might be looking left and right because they're, yeah. they're walking to the crossing or they might be moving towards the crossing and then stopping and looking left and right mm -hmm. so if you're aware of that then obviously you can be knowing whether they're going to cross or not yeah, yeah? going to turn left at the traffic lights Wow, I'm really liking those mirror checks today. They're really good. Thank you. I've been practicing. Well done. Yeah, it's good. Oh, well done. That was really nice as well. Really made a difference last week, didn't it? Yeah. Okay, so we've got another crossing coming up there. Yeah. yeah. So the band's just gone past. We're going to check the mirrors. We're going to ease down a little bit because we can't really see to the right. So now we're going to scan the area. Yeah, nobody, Is it safe? safe yeah, Nobody's nobody pressed there, it. Look, yeah, yeah light, that's it. Lights. So we can keep moving okay. through. And then we're going to turn left at the main set of traffic lights. Mm -hmm. That's it. Lovely. Well done. sunny today yeah do you think that might make a difference on the crossings uh, yes it's a bit uh, harder to oh we have crossings that's it yeah so check your mirrors ease off scan the area yeah, yeah it's clear. that's it look at the box does it make it difficult to see the box because it's sunny yes it's, it is that's it. you have to really concentrate to see it that's it yeah and then obviously you know if it was raining that might take away the fact that you might not be able to see the pedestrian walking up yeah. because they're they're rushing because it's raining yeah yeah so a lot of things affect pedestrian crossings don't they yeah yeah so we're going to pull up and park on the left then yeah, yeah. yeah. in a safe place that's it good well done okay so just knock the indicator off that's it good okay so we've done that twice then mm -hmm. yeah tell me what went well for you doing that 
uh, on the second round I start is the first time you told me to hook out on a box uh, scan the area around it and then on second round I done it well before you told me and I even spot myself the sign <laughs> for the pedestrian crossing yeah superb superb did anything not go so well for you uh, oh I don't know Okay. I don't know, maybe you can tell me. <laughs> okay, so uh, there, there wasn't actually, it was really good, yeah? Doesn't have to be anything wrong, yeah? So I've just got a quick question for you then, mm -hmm. yeah? So we're approaching a pedestrian crossing. Can you just tell me what the routine is that we've been using? So we're checking the mirrors, yeah. uh, we're slowing down, yeah. uh, we're scanning area around it, see if it's anybody there, if it's anybody press the box uh, on, on on the lights, yeah. if it's all clear we uh, continue through proceeding, if obviously if not then we're not coming to it. <laughs> yeah, we're going to come to that yeah. stuff aren't we, yeah. yeah? So that was really good, that shows me that you've learned quite a lot there, yeah? Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do again is, we're going to do that circuit again, mm -hmm. yeah? What would you need from me to do that circuit again? Uh, maybe see, just see if I do any mistakes, just monitor me, okay. see if I can do it myself. Okay, okay. So we were at a two when we first started, weren't we, on that yeah. scale. Where would you put yourself now? Uh, probably four probably four yeah, yeah. Uh, that's really good i really like that yeah so just to be clear then yeah we're about a four at the minute yep we're going to do the circuit again and you just want me to sit and watch just in case there's anything happening yep yeah and obviously we've got to share responsibility yep. so again i want you to drive safely and comfortably and within the law yeah yep. and if there's any safety critical incidents i can use the foot brake or the mm -hmm. clutch I can push the wheel away, yeah? Yeah. Can you just repeat that back to me before yeah, we start? Yeah, so you off? again want me to drive nice and safely, uh, respect the other users. If it's any critical situation occur, you, you can touch your controls or touch the steering wings to correct the situation. Superb. Really good, yeah? yeah.